The frigate Canterbury made a spectacular exit today as it sank beneath the waves in the Bay of Islands. The 36-year-old frigate's been sunk in deep water cove to attract both sea life and visiting divers. Adam Ray reports. A fiery flash in three decades of New Zealand's naval history is sunk. The frigate Canterbury was scuttled at Deepwater Cove in the Bay of Islands, and the wreck would become a dive site. It was a bittersweet day for those who had served on the frigate. When I first arrived on board the ship today, I just couldn't uh, pick a more beautiful spot for it to lay for it. The Canterbury began service in 1971 and served New Zealand's interests around the world. The frigate was retired in 2005 and sold to the Bay of Islands Charitable Trust for just one dollar. The Trust have spent hundreds of thousands of dollars cleaning and stripping the frigate so it can be scuttled. Explosive experts brought in from the UK will use less than 10 kilos of special charges to blow holes in the Canterbury's hull. Groups of boats and thousands of spectators watch the scuttling. Tourism officials expect the wreck to become a mecca for divers. Once we get in and market it, um, and um, uh, I'm sure they'll come here and, and, and buy one, uh, because it's only at uh, 30 metres, you can actually snorkel on it as well. It took just minutes to send the Canterbury to the bottom. Divers will enjoy it for years to come. Adam Ray, 3 News.